Global. Don't play with you. Um, I ain't the one. Woo, 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 woo. And then that's when the song shifted and it got the that's on me. Mm. And then she. So so before the cameras actually came out, Yellow Beezy and dude are actually already exchanged words before. Yeah yeah, then. yeah for sure for sure. So Yellow Beezy came back to him, or, yeah. or dude was dude just steady talking. Dude was steady talking, and then okay. yeah, when that's on me came, that's when Yellow got out the crowd. He said, "Yeah, sure, I'm gonna come right there to, to you in front of your face and shit." And he got the. Saying what he said in front of the nigga. Yeah. yeah. He got to saying what he said or whatever the case may be. You know what I'm saying? I feel like, you know, in this case, I feel like Yellow wasn't really in the wrong. He's standing his ground, shoot, dude, didn't really have to do all that. I don't for think sure. it was for all that. For sure, for sure, for sure. That definitely was an R and B vibe. It was yeah, it was, R&B the, it was vibe. an R and B vibe for sure, for sure. Uh now shit. Yellow Beezy posted like he did the dance first. And mm-hmm. I actually I ain't gonna lie to you, I never knew that. Yeah, I ain't never know that either. I I'm never knew Yellow lie. Beezy did the dance first. Now, being as though like you were uh Mo Three official cameraman, you did a lot of work with Mo Three. Like seeing that, how you felt about it? Uh, I mean, I just feel like shoot, whoever started they started the dance, however it go. I don't. I think it's it's irrelevant. The dance irrelevant. I mean, I think that because we didn't know that Yellow did that. First, I think three took over the da- dance because that's what I know no three dancing by. So I would say that, you know what I'm saying? But I mean, shoot, if that's what he want to say, he started it first, then that's cool. Like, you know what I'm saying? I mean, shit, he basically proved that he started oh, he it first. Pro- yeah, he, I mean, yeah, he you proved You know what I'm saying? He, like, he, nigga, I ain't going to lie, bro. I never knew that shit. Yeah, that, I mean, that was it, some news to me. Like, you know what I'm yeah, saying? But, I never knew but that. But me knowing, me knowing three, I know how three, three, three antics and he – Funny, so he probably did take take the, take his shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He probably did take it like in a <laughs> sense. I would say he he, sure. probably, he probably did just take yellow shit and say shit. Nigga, it's my shit type shit now. Yeah. I feel like nah, for sure, for sure. Now, overall, how you feel like Yellow Beezy handled that situation? Um, uh, I think he stood. His, I think he stood his ground. Uh, he did what he was supposed to do. I mean, I, I, these fans, I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. These fans, they've been getting, they've been wilding lately, like just in general, just all across the gl- the board, just everywhere. You know what I'm saying? I just feel like, shoot, for a person to say what they said, and all that, like in the, in the, I, I think he, I think he handled it correctly. That's what I think. I think he handled it correctly. I think, you know what I mean? Long as it didn't escalate even more, then I would have been like, nah, he shouldn't be doing it because it's not his show. It's really not his show. He came there just to show love type shit. He didn't come there for I'm pretty sure Bro, he didn't come there for all that. For sure, it's crazy how all the blogs picked that up, though. Oh, yeah, like, I knew they was going like to pick it, it up. It was blogs from other cities, though. Mm-hmm. Posting it first. That's why we on Dallas Global posted it too, because I'm like, damn. Oh yeah, no, nah, for sure. <laughs> Excuse me. It was like, like, like for a good list two songs. He was it, bro, ass like instantly. As soon as he damn there came yeah, on so stage. Is it safe to say Yellow Beezy kind of tired of people playing with his name? Yeah, for sure. I'm pretty sure. Like he want to get shit understood. He trying to, you know, he don't want to get shit involved in, you know, whoever they saying that he involved with. You know what I'm saying with all the situations with three and you know everything whatever the case may be i feel like he just want to just you know move on type shit but he gonna have to know that shit that's just what that shit come with bro you're gonna deal with that shit for a minute for sure show, for sure show. now i did an interview with mogul media shout out mogul media by the way for sure. and i basically said uh that yellow beezy is not a likable guy in dallas did you catch that yeah i caught it i saw it now if you had to say like if you have to put your personal opinion on it, like, yo, how uh, how high of a percentage do you think that's accurate? Uh, I think it's very accurate. I think it's 95% accurate. I think 5% that of people that fuck with him is Oak Cliff and Lancaster, like, combined. Okay. And I think the other 95%. Don't like him. Nigga. Why though? Like, why do you th- why do you think that switch happened, bro? Because I remember, like I said in in the interview, bro. Like it was a point in time where, like, the city fucking love Yellow Beezy, bro. I ain't gonna lie uh, to you. It come a time where shoe, it's just based off how you move and how you really like. A lot of people, like, I, like a lot of people be hurting out in here in the city, so they gonna jump on your wave. You know what I'm saying? When they ain't hurting and when they feel like you useful, but when you un- when you can't be touched, and he got to a level where he you know, couldn't get reached or whatever. When you can't get reached and people start like, oh, they started like, nah, you ain't even that, you ain't this and that, you know what I'm saying? You ain't really connected in with the streets for real. You just following behind this and that. So I feel like they probably look at it like that. But I feel like dude just kick with his family, be at the crib, you know what I mean? Get his money, have and just be out the way type shit. But I feel like they just don't like him because of 
certain situations they always put out on the internet and you know the passing of mo3 and even though you know we don't know who got something to do with what but i just feel like that's just what it is though no nah, for sure 